Good morning, it's Chuck at Timberbend Farm. Hey, coming to you this morning with a little follow-up video about the dump trailer rental. Our dump trailer had been rented out, and then this weekend we actually had it at home at our build site. We had a lot of cleaning up to do there, and we took all the trash and things from the build site and what got that put in the dump trailer and it really wasn't but about a half a trailer load but i needed to get rid of that here first thing on a monday morning and uh, here in north alabama today it's raining and i go to my normal landfill where i, I normally go to, to dump and the lady at the landfill the first thing she says to me before good morning hello or anything she says do you have four-wheel drive and tow hooks and i said uh yeah, sure. So she said, go on up to the top of the hill. I said, okay. So I pulled back to where I normally go and uh, it's a pretty steep incline. And I stopped at the bottom and locked it in four wheel drive and I made it about 50 feet up the incline, dead stop. Keep in mind, it's uh, about 6.15 in the morning. I had to leave my house about 5.20 to, uh, to get to the landfill to get to this point. It's raining, it's dark, cold. But anyway, I get to the landfill and now I'm trying to get up to the, the landing up on top to get unloaded and to no go. So I'm able to kind of slip back down the, the incline and get truck and trailer turned around, go back up to the way station and tell the lady I, I wasn't able to make it. So she said, that's, that's fine, I'll just void out your ticket. Well, now I've spent 45, 50 minutes, an hour of, of my time a good bit of diesel fuel to uh, to get to the landfill, and I'm no better off than I was an hour ago. Uh, just so happens there's a transfer station that's actually a little closer to my home and uh, to my my home office, but it's more expensive. The transfer station is a lot easier to dump at, but where the uh, landfill gets twenty six dollars a ton the transfer station gets $85 a ton. That's expensive. So for me, uh, because I knew I didn't have much on, I, I thought, well, uh, we'll give that a try this morning. So we ended up taking it to the transfer station. And let me look at my receipt here. I had 0.3 of a ton, uh, 620 pounds is, uh, is all I had. So transfer station this morning, my fee there was $30.17 based on a $85 rate. So yes, hey, good good news. I got uh, the trailer cleaned out because I have a rental tomorrow and I have to leave with the trailer at seven o'clock to uh, to make it to my drop there and uh, in time and I didn't go back and pick it up on Thursday. So this morning has been quite an adventure. It's uh, just before eight o'clock and I'm, I'm just now getting to the office. Uh, I've been up and going since about five and in my previous video, I mentioned that, you know, this is a, a thing that you could do, but you, you may just have to get up and get going a little early. You may have to work late. Uh, there, there's just some exceptions. And today's one of those for me. Sometimes during the days I can, I can take off from my, I say job from our other, one of our other businesses and, and I have some free time and go deal with the dump trailer during the day. Uh, today wasn't going to be one of those. I've got appointments and other things that uh, I need to get done today. So I needed to get the dump trailer dealt with early. Anyway, just an adventure. Another day in uh, self-employment land. Today is one of those days. So anyway, we're going to keep getting after it. Um, you know, there's nothing like being self-employed. There's nothing like uh, calling your own shots and being successful on your own. I have a lot of good support, a lot of good support staff around me, but it's, uh, it's a lot better than working for somebody else, I can tell you that. So anyway, y'all have a great day. Thanks for listening in, and I'll catch you on the next video.